Good morning, beautiful ladies. I am putting on my eyebrows. I've already done one here and I'm using Bird and I'm using the Hotline brush and it's got a slanted end and it's got a spoolie. So I combed it out and I filled it in. And now I'm gonna do the other one. Okay, so I've done my eyebrows. It looks a little dark because I don't have any other makeup on, but I didn't go too far down. You don't want to pull your face down. And I made sure that my arch, which I don't have a really defined arch, but it, that it goes from my pupil like this. It goes from my pupil that way. That way. All right, so that's my eyebrows with Bird. And in order to set that, what you can do is you can take your protector sponge and you can put a little setting spray on there. And I have the Saint Sp setting spray here. Spray that on there, okay. And then you can just press it in. Press it in and let it dry. All right, I'll be back with my eyeshadow. Hello, all right, now I'm gonna do a three eyeshadow combo and I have Arabian Nights, which is a cream. I have Tawanda, which is a shimmer. And then I have Drift, which is also a shimmer. And then I will be using um, Black Friday as my eyeliner. So we are going to apply, first of all, I have used, just so you know, I used um, a little bit of the uh, eyeshadow primer before I started. And so this, since this is a cream, it's a little harder to get on, but I'm just gonna apply it with my fingers for right now. So we've got that applied. And now what I'm going to do is I'm gonna take Tawanda. And because I have mature skin on my eyes, as you can see, I do have a little bit of wrinkles going on there. I don't wanna to put too much shimmer I'm just gonna do it on the very top of my lid in the center. What do you think of that? That's really pretty, isn't it? All right, and so what I'm gonna do real quick is I'm gonna just clean up the bottom here. And since it's Arabian Nights is a cream. The only reason it got down there is because my finger moved it down there. All right, so now we're going to use Drift right here. And I am going to get the end. Let's see, I'll use the smudge brush. I'm gonna use the smudge brush. And I'm just gonna put it up here. All right, and then I'm gonna take a, another brush and I'm just gonna kind of blend that out a little bit. All right, and then what we can do is, is I'm gonna put a little bit of the Arabian Nights underneath. So I'm in the Arabian Nights and I'm gonna use the end of my eyeshadow brush. All right, soften it up a little bit. All right, what do you think? Really pretty. All right, now we're gonna put on our Black Friday eyeliner. And that one, I am going to use the end of the line brush. And I'm gonna dip it in my back. And now Black Friday eyeliner is a cream powder mix. So, it goes on really good. You can see I got it on the end there and I do have to use this guy here. So I'm just gonna line the top of my eye of my eyelid to make my eyelashes look a little thicker. But you don't need a lot because a little goes a long way. And depending on how you like your 
eyeliner, you can do it as thick or as thin as you want, and you can make it any shape that you want. This is the one I'm gonna go with today. All right, now we're ready for mascara. And I'm gonna use uh, the Luminous Original, and it does have a primer, so I'm going to use the primer today. I don't always use the primer, but today we'll use it. It's gonna come out white, so don't freak out. We'll let that dry, and then I will fill it in. I do not put mascara on the bottom of my lids, of my eyes, because it gets down here. Every once in a while I will. All right, we are done with that. I do notice I have a little piece here. We're done with that and I will be back and I will do my makeup. All right, now I'm gonna put my makeup on. I've got my palette here with all my goodies. I've switched my colors around. I'm doing a little bit more pinks today. So let's get started. Do contour first. All right, now we are going to do my main, I have three different highlights here. This is my darker one, this is my brightening one, and this is my medium one. So I'm gonna start with my medium one. All right, now I'm gonna to go to my darker one. And now I'm gonna to go to my lightest one. I'm gonna stay away from my, underneath my eye as much as possible, because that's where all my wrinkles are. And I don't want to accentuate my wrinkles. All right, I'm gonna let that warm up, and then we're gonna blend, and then we'll go the next step. All right, we're ready to blend. Today, I'm going to blend with my Perfector sponge because I do have uh, older skin and I have wrinkles and I have all that fun stuff that comes with aging. I am going to spray a little bit of my setting spray on my Perfector sponge and I'm gonna blend everything but my contour. I'll do my contour last. All right, now I'm ready for the contour, and I am going to blend at the end of my blush and bronzer brush. And I'm taking it up, and this is gonna give me that three-dimensional look where I don't look flat. All right. All right. Now I am going to do my bronzer. And I have Bella bronzer right here. I'm gonna put that on the middle of my forehead. I'm gonna put it a tad bit above my contour. Do my chin and do a little bit on my nose there. And I like to do it on my neck. Okay, as you can see, my face is nice and warmed up. It doesn't look flat. All right, now I'm going to do a ombre for my lip, uh, for my cheek and my lip. But right now we're just gonna do the cheek. I have Hollywood and I have Black Cherry. So get into that. And I'm going kind of over where the bronzer was on that part of the cheek. 
but I'm not going to go too far inside. This is black cherry here. It's the darker one. All right, and then we will blend that in. All right, I'm back. I'm going to contour my lips, and then I'm going to use Hollywood and Black Cherry, and then I'm going to set it with a little bit of the Tawanda, which is what I used on my eyes. So let's go ahead and contour. I'm using indigo to line and contour a little bit. And I'm going to take my finger and I'll get out of those corners. You don't want to be in the corners. All right, now I am going to use um, use Hollywood. I think I'm just going to apply it with my finger. Hollywood is a satin. So it's a little bit matte. But it has a little bit of gold shimmer in it. And now I'm going to go back in with Black Cherry which is this one right here. It looks very scary, but it's not. It's actually a beautiful, look how pretty it is. And I'm gonna go on the side here. And now I'm gonna use Tawanda. And this will really Lock in your lip color, and it ends up matching your eyes. All right, so I am going to, last but not least, I'm going to set with some powder, and I'm going to use the powder brush here, and I like to use air spun, or air, yeah, air spun. All right, and it's a loose powder. Here it is. So I'm going to use this end of the I'm going to let that sit for just a couple of seconds and then I will brush it off and that will really lock in my makeup for the day. And the goal after this is to not touch my face at all. Just let the makeup do what the makeup's supposed to do. All right. Well, thank you for joining me. Bye.